Struggling to choose between stock photos and custom shots for your business? Let's talk about how to make the best decision to captivate your audience and elevate your brand. Hi everyone, I'm Rochelle Reimers, Demos Communications and Publications Chief. And let's take a few minutes to weigh the pros and cons of stock photos versus custom photography. Each has the power to elevate your business's authenticity and appeal. Stock photos are cost-effective and time-saving. They offer high-quality professional images in a wide variety of subjects, themes, and styles. This variety provides you with many options to quickly find images that fit your needs without the hassle or expense of organizing a photo shoot. Using stock photos from the same source or collection can also help maintain a consistent visual style, which is very beneficial in maintaining a cohesive message or brand identity. However, stock photos can often look generic or may not perfectly represent your brand's unique qualities. The risk of overuse by other businesses can also diminish originality and customization is limited since stock photos can't be tailored to specific products, people, or locations unique to your business, although the use of AI is quickly changing this. On the other hand, using your own photos offers authenticity, providing a genuine representation of your business, products, and team, which helps build trust with your audience. Custom photos allow for complete control over the style, composition, and content, ensuring they align perfectly with your brand identity. This can help set your business apart from competitors who are using generic stock images. However, this authenticity comes at a cost. Professional photography can be expensive and time-consuming. It requires planning, staging, and often extensive post-production work. High-quality photography also demands skill, expertise, proper equipment, and so on, whether you do it yourself or hire a professional. Whether you decide to use stock photos or your own, there are several best practices to keep in mind. Use high-resolution images to ensure they appear professional and crisp. Use images that match your business's tone and message while avoiding overly generic or cliche visuals. As much as possible, make sure your photos reflect a diverse and inclusive population and maintain a consistent visual style. If you decide that stock photography is the best option for you, there are many resources available where you can find the right stock photos for your business. They include, but are certainly not limited to, Unsplash, which offers high resolution, free to use photos uploaded by photographers from around the world. Pexels, which provides a large library of free stock photos and videos contributed by community of photographers. Pixabay offers a vast collection of free images, videos, and music all shared by the community. Shutterstock is a paid service offering a vast library of high quality images, vectors, videos, and music. Adobe Stock, which is integrated with Adobe Creative Cloud and offers a comprehensive collection of high quality royalty-free images, videos, templates, and 3D assets. Getty Images, which is a leading stock photo agency known for its extensive and premium quality collection of images, videos, and music and Canva, which is an online design tool that includes a library of free and premium photos, illustrations, and templates for use in various design programs. When using stock photos, it's crucial to understand the different types of licenses and be aware of restrictions. Make sure you thoroughly review the terms of usage and select the appropriate license for each photo to avoid legal complications. As you can see, both stock photos and custom photography offer unique benefits and challenges. Ultimately, the best choice depends on your specific needs, budget, and the message you wish to convey. By carefully weighing the pros and cons and adhering to best practices, you can make an informed decision that effectively captivates your audience and elevates your brand's presence. If you have any questions or need further guidance, please feel free to reach out. My email is rochelle at dima.org.